Welcome to the number one podcast for the Portland Trailblazers. Hard-hitting news, credible sources. Episode one. Okay. Intro one. Hello, everyone. We're going to touch on some hard-hitting Blazers news today, such as are the Blazers the cause of Oregon's low graduation rates? We'll let you decide because it won't be mentioned again. We'll talk about Blazer injuries, maybe have some interviews or whatever. I would really suggest the movie Birdman. I just really thought it was great. Cannot suggest it enough. Just really well done. Tight script, great acting. It was the real deal. Intro 2. Intro 2. Intro 2. Intro 2. All right, hello. My name's Tyler. I'm sitting next to Matt. Yeah. If you're not slamming with the best, then you might as well not even be in the NBA. Rick, Dame has been slumping because of the increase in defensive pressure on Dame. And Evan, if you want to see Myers Leonard shooting threes, you're going to have to dribble drive. And we're here to discuss some Blazers news. Discussion time. Now we'd like to talk about who should get the minutes off the bench. Tyler, what do you have to say? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's pretty obvious. I think that Will the Thrill Barton is the way to go. He's, He's been playing great. Champ. His defense, yeah, his rebounding, good. his scoring, his alley-oops, amazing. He can dunk. For reals, do you feel his defensive ability is on an NBA level? Um, He's in the NBA, so yeah, I think it's on an NBA level. If LaMarcus Aldridge has to take a extended leave of absence, who's going to fill that role? Well, I think in the two games he was gone, we saw the answer is no one. Evan, how do you feel about Steve Blake being the all-time assist leader in Maryland? Do you think that's really assisting him on the court? Well, he did win an NCAA championship. He has a championship pedigree, and not many players on the Blazers have that. He is a great addition to the Blazers team. Everything you need off the bench, a true veteran, a classy guy. Victor Claver time. Matt, how do you feel Victor has been performing as a trailblazer? You know, I feel like he uh, he brings a lot of unique things to the table. He has, uh, for example, two gold medals playing on the national teams of uh, 2009 po- Poland and 2011 Lithuania. That's a very unique experience. Not a lot of people bring that to the table. Well, you know, his experience is great. I'm not sure he ever played for Poland. I think he played for Spain, but couldn't be sure. Did you say Poland? Oh, 100% he played for Poland. He played for two is different that, countries in the World Cup. We, is that what you said? Yeah, yeah can we, can yeah. we look that up? Is that's that true? For, I don't think that's true. He's actually played for four different countries. I that, think he played against those countries. He was for Spain and beat those countries. I think you maybe shouldn't be our stat guy. I'm reasonably sure. Wait, wait, wait. Sorry. 